We are standing in the middle of the courtyard, leading to the entrance to the tomb. I'm walking through the doors, uh, entering to the actual tomb. On the sides, on both, on both of the sides, you can see huge square pillars. Above them, there was ashlar, building stones, rising to the height of more than three, four meters. Roofing with the huge slabs of stones above them was probably a second floor. By no means, it was a marvelous thing, a very unique object. I'm now standing in the middle of the tomb. Between the pillars you can see the place of the burial. It's like, like a big cyst. I'm pointing on them. In this place was the sarcophagus, the place where they put the body of the dead person. On the floor of this niche we find a mosaic floor decorated with a cross. Actually at the minute we find the cross, this is the end of the story because it's a Christian site. It could not be the actual tomb of the Maccabean. But yet, I remind you the saying of the famous archaeologist Charles Le Morganot, who excavated in this actual place in 1871. And Charles Le Morganot tells us, listen carefully, he said, uh, the Maccabean were a sacred people, were martyrs. Uh, uh, the early Christianity adored the Maccabean. Imagine, without the Maccabean, the Christianity was not giving birth. We all, Jewish, Christian, et, 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 together would pray to idols. Because of that, Christianity, the Maccabean are very, very important to Christianity. Probably, early Christianity seek the tomb of the Maccabean, identify them, maybe here, and decorated them with those mosaic. It's another layer in the fascinating story of this place. We, at the Israeli Antiquity Authority, um, wanted to solve this ancient riddle and we initiate an excavation here. We excavated already uh, like a month. We revealed again this magnificent tomb, but yet we do not have the actual proof that would enable us to tell you that this was the actual tomb of the Maccabean. By no means, this is a unique and special building. Maybe its unique the uniqueness testified about who was buried it. We, the Israeli Antiquity Authority, seek to continue the excavation here. The site is much, much larger than we see right now. There are surprises it, wa surprises waiting us to our to archaeologists to be revealed. Maybe in the future we will find the right proof.